Hey, you guys. Don't mind how I'm looking. I know um, I look different than in my other videos. I did that on purpose because I enjoy all of your guys' comments and everything, but I really want you to listen to what I have to say about using eBay and Craigslist to actually make some money. Just wanted to give you an update. Um, I don't know if you've seen my other videos, but I've been selling on eBay um, basically since 2007, but I really started using Craigslist as my method of getting items to sell. And that was back in May. So within the past two months, I've grossed over $2,000 in sales. And I wanted to give you new information um, off of my last videos. I was talking about how I would place ads on Craigslist for um, getting people's broken computers. I'd place an ad saying that I'll give you $30 for your broken laptop, you know, text me or email me the make and model of your laptop. And then I'd do a quick uh, search on eBay to see if it was an item that was actually worth me buying from Craigslist to sell on eBay. If it was, I'd go on um, and give them a call back or a text and say, yeah, you know, I want to meet you at such and such place and uh, buy your computer. Well, what I found out from doing that, um, I did pretty good. You know, I'd get a hold of a computer maybe once every other day or so, sometimes every day. Um, did okay with that. Um, mostly profited at least like made a profit of between 30 and $80, depending on the make and model of the laptop. But I wanted to do a quick update because I realized that if I offer more money for people's broken computers on Craigslist, then it's more of a uh, later model uh, laptop that I can get more money for on eBay. So now what I do is I offer $60 for people's broken laptop. And I'm able to do that because I've made a um, substantial amount of money, I guess, doing it um, offering $30. I hope I'm not confusing you guys. It's very simple once you get used to it. So anyway, not only do I place ads offering $60 for people's broken laptop, um, when I get responses from that, like I said, the laptops are newer models and they go for much more on eBay. So now um, I can make an average profit of between like $40 and $80 more consistently than when I was getting them for $30. When I was buying the laptops for $30, they were older, mostly running Windows XP. Some would run, you know, Windows 7 or, you know, but for the most part, they were older. And I found out, you know, you offer more money for something, you know, people are more likely to give up their later model computers for more money. It just makes sense. So that seems to be working. Um, one other way that I do get um, the laptops from Craigslist, um, a lot quicker is and I guess this is like kind of like I don't know good but not good because it's kind of like spamming people but what I do is I'll go to the Craigslist um, and I mean Craigslist website and I'll do a search in like the computer category electronics category um, what else uh, cell phone category and just different categories and I'll do a search and I'll type in my area code so once I type in my area code it brings me a list of numbers up of people that have ads uh, people that have their phone number listed in their ads I don't know if you just heard that sound but that was my eBay notifications telling me an item that I had sold just actually sold um, anyway so I'll do a search for my area code. It'll bring me up a list of ads that have their telephone number. And in most cases, it's a cell phone number um, listed in their ad. It doesn't matter if they're selling a, a laptop, you know, um, letting you know of a garage sale that they're going to have. I mean, it can just be anything. But I found that I have more success in people contacting me back from um, electronics category, computer um, even resumes because people are looking for ways to you know make money like find a job or whatever so they posted up the resume so anyway so Craigslist will bring you up a whole list of all the ads that have the phone numbers in their ads and what I do is I have a Google voice number um, I'm gonna make another video on that where basically um, you can send text messages and there's also a number of other features you can do all from the computer. So what I do is I open up two windows and my Craigslist window open with my list of um, numbers and I'll just copy and paste um, 
in the the section where you can send text messages. So, shh, sorry about that. So what I do is I send text messages and I say, hi, just letting you know that I buy broken laptops for $60. I did this with the, the $30 thing as well too, but now I do it at $60. So I'll open up my Google Voice and if you want, you know, Google Google Voice and you'll see all the different features that it has and whatnot. But anyway, so I'll send text messages and I'll just copy and paste the message saying, hi, just letting you know, I buy broken laptops for $60. And I'll click over to the Craigslist, um, the listing that I have with all the numbers. Um, and I'll just go to each one and I'll just copy and paste that text message. And I get like so many responses. I think in one day I got like a list of probably 25 people that had broken laptops. And out of those, I think like three or four were ones that I, were, I was able to get like just like that. Now, I don't really recommend you like doing that because um, you know sometimes people they don't want to be spammed but at the same time you know you're not like selling them something you're offering to buy something from them so uh, most times they're not even mad that I'm sending them these text messages you know most cases they'll be like well who is this you know um, do I know you um, but for the ones that really do have a broken laptop or a laptop that they just don't want anymore they will respond they'll say yeah I have one sometimes they say yeah I have two so in that case I just send an email or a text message back and I say okay what is the make and model number of your laptop and what all is wrong with it and they're glad to tell me and they're anxious to meet up like just like that so you know when you do this when you send the, um, the text messages out letting people know hey you know I'll give you X amount of dollars for your broken laptop be prepared to like meet up with them that day because I found out that sometimes they change their mind once they see that there's like some sort of market for their item they'll you know they'll have too much time to think about it when I started doing that sending the messages out I just wanted to gather a whole list of people that had broken laptops and I'm kind of learning this as I go along it wasn't until you know I wait like one or two days because I'd wait for you know an item that I already had on eBay I would wait for that to sell and then use some of the money for that to purchase my next computer so during that one to two day time frame you know I would call them back and be like hey yeah you know I want to meet you I texted you the other day you said you had a broken laptop and they would be like oh I'm sorry that's no longer available and I'm like man you know I gave them the idea it's worth something and then they listed it and then sold it so just be ready to go out and get it ASAP once you see that it's uh, an item um, a laptop that actually sells pretty well on eBay just be ready to get it because people are so impatient and you know if they specify a time you know just agree go with it you know um, this is something that you know basically you you work at your own pace or you know work when you want but also at the same time you know you need to be able to work with I guess you could say your customers so um, it's going really good it's going great now I'm also not only um, getting a hold of laptops broken and you know some are not broken but they the people I get them from sometimes they think they are broken um, but I'm doing the laptops and I'm also doing um, smartphones too it works with smartphones um, you'd be amazed people you know they want to upgrade their cell phone excuse me and there's not necessarily anything wrong with the one that they had um, but they just want to upgrade their phone and then they just have this one laying around and the main thing is you know try to talk them down from from their price that they're advertising on Craigslist you know just let them know you know send a text message and be like yeah you know I saw your ad on Craigslist for your Motorola Droid I say Motorola Droid because they sell well on eBay I just sold one a few minutes ago and I think I picked it up like two hours ago and I just sold it so I'm saying Motorola Droid for a reason but anyway um, if it's listed on Craigslist for $75, I think I talked this one guy down to $50 yesterday. Got one for $60 today, but I talked him down to $50, and it sold on eBay for like $90. So it's just, I guess you could do this with anything, basically. I'm just doing it with items that I'm most familiar with. So anyway, I feel like I'm rambling on. 
Um, if you haven't given it a try, give it a try. If you are skeptical, feel free to check. I'm sorry. Bleh. Feel free to check out my eBay user ID, Navar813. That's N-A-V-A-R in the number 813. And just check out, uh, do a completed listing search for a lot of the items that I've sold. Everything I've listed has sold. Um, but I'm just like so excited about it. Every day I wake up and I'm like, you know, my goal at first when I started doing this, like really like extensively in May, my goal was to sell like one item, um, one item a week. And then I was like, okay, well, let's see if I could sell maybe one like every three or four days so that was working and then I'm like well why don't I just try to sell something you know every day so that's working and now I sell a couple things every day so like I said just check out my items that I sold and you'll see um, past few days past couple weeks I've been selling like a few items every day um, sometimes I have to slow myself down because I don't want to like confuse myself or get mixed up of what has to go where and you know what has to ship out this at the other um, another suggestion I have um, the way that I'm able to um, sell items on eBay every day is I make my listings uh, buy it now I don't list them like auction style I don't like to wait for money that's the thing with me I just want to list it and have it be sold like by the time I wake up in the morning or within a few hours like in this case today I had one that sold just a few hours later and then one that actually sold in the middle of the night last night um, normally when you sell items on eBay there's you know the books say you know list your items on the weekends like Friday night and make them seven day auctions so you have like two weekends to for your item to actually be seen but with the laptops and the smartphones I mean I've been selling them every day it doesn't matter and I've been doing it as buy it now okay so I don't want to keep rambling just try it check me out on eBay give it a try I mean it's not gonna hurt anything as long as you have the money to pay the people on Craigslist just list it on eBay and you know see what it goes for all right I love to hear guys' comments other than the comments about my lips and my hair and the this and the that. I really want you guys to give this a try. You know, I'm one that likes to learn and I like to share knowledge. So on that note, see you later. Bye.